Hey guys, this is going to be my Squishy Collection video, part one. Um, it's going to be probably really long, so I apologize for that, and I am breaking it up into two parts so that it, it'll, you know, the video won't be as long, but it's still going to be pretty long because I just wanted to show you each one and kind of tell you if they're squishy or not and where they're from and stuff, and I know most other Squishy Collection videos, they just show you real fast each one, but I'm going to kind of tell you a bit about it. So. First, let me tell you that I keep my squishies in two separate boxes. I have one, like, giant black box, which is, like, over there. And then I have this small pink box. And, um, the pink one, I keep my favorite squishies in, like, top, top favorites. And then the black box, I have everything else in because it's way bigger and not everything fits in the pink box. And I've actually had to, like, even though I have some of the squishies that I really, really love in the black box, because they don't, I mean, there's isn't enough room in the pink one. So I'm going to do the black box first, and these aren't in any order or anything. I'm just going to show you as I grab them. So let's get started. The first squishy I have is my Jumbo Panda Bun. It's the girl with the red bow. Then I've got my boy with his tongue sticking out. And I've got the, and the normal boy. And these aren't that squishy. Um, I have like one that's really squishy, it's in the end of the other box, but these just, they're not that squishy. And I got them from an eBay seller, um, called Dorothy Wonderland. Then I've got, um, this little medium panda bun that I got for my sister. And this one's pretty squishy, and this one was from another eBay seller from China. So that's, this one actually took super, super long to get to us. Then I have the mini panda buns, which I also got from Dorothy Wonderland got the little girl with the pink bow, the boy with his tongue, tongue sticking out, the girl with the red bow, and the regular boy. And these are all really squishy. So I've got those. Um, next I have this pink donut. And it's the, it's like a knockoff of the Bredo donuts. It's not a real Bredo donut. But I really still like it. It's a really pretty color. It's got the swirl. And it's it's pretty squishy. And I got this one from a store envy. It's called Kawaii Space. And I still I just still really like it. This one doesn't have a strap or anything. Um I've also got this green fake bread donut. And this is not as squishy, but it's still really pretty. And I think this one is from a eBay seller called Taddy Bear, and I actually have a lot of squishies from him or her. I don't know if it's a boy or girl, but um, they're based in Hawaii, I think. So I've got that one. Then I have these um, jumbo marshmallow buns, and I don't really like these. This one is really soft, but they're not squishy at all. They have a black cell phone strap, and they're they're pretty big, as you can see. Then I've got the um, the white one, and it's not squishy at all. It's like a piece of foam. So I've got that. Um, next squishy, I really, really, really love this one. It's a roti toast that I got from a store envy, and it's called um, Kawaii Korea. And it is really, really squishy. It's the kind that's supposed to like hold your cell phone, so it's got little holes. And I really love the texture in between the slices, and in between the slices is really, really squishy as well. And this one doesn't have a strap or anything. But I, this one's really awesome to squish. And it's huge. And I just, I love this one. So, yeah. Um, I have a Bredo tortoise, which I really, really love. It is really, really cool texture. And it smells good. And it's squishy. And he's got the cutest little face. So I love him. I've got this pie cho roll. And this one's like super realistic and it smells good as well and it's really soft. It's not that squishy, but it's really, really soft. Um, I know the this one I think I got from Kawaii Land and the Breaded Tortoise I got from some eBay seller. Um, next I have this big Hello Kitty toast. It's not licensed, but it's got this little Hello Kitty with a chef's hat. Um, this one I got, also got from a store envy seller called Kawaii Desu, and it's more foamy, and I don't really like the texture that much, but it's still, it's fun to, like, play with, and it, I love the back, but, yeah, there's that one, 
Then I've got this Minnie Mouse Toast, Jumbo Toast. And this one is from Decoden Accessories, or it's cute. It's got a silver ball chain. And it's not a licensed one, but it's very soft and squishy, and I love the texture and the smell as well. I've also got a Bretto Slice of Love. This one I really like. It's very squishy and fun to play with. And it's very, very big. It's like as big as my hand. But it is kind of plain. It didn't come with like the icing that you're supposed to decorate it with. So I've got to find something to decorate it with. But I really like this one too. Um, next I have a Relicuma Hamburger. It's got a yellow cell phone strap. It is not squishy at all. I was pretty ex much expecting that. I just thought it was so, so cute. So that's why I got that one. And... Um, I'm trying to remember. I think this one was also from Kawaii Desu. So that's that one. And I also from her, just uh, this too. This Chef House Squishy was from her too. And this one's really smooth and soft, but it's not very squishy. And it's pretty small, too. Um, next, I have the Dollar Tree squishies. So I've got the basketball. These are all really squishy, and they're like a dollar at the Dollar Tree, Michaels, and Walmart. I've got the football, and my football's not as squishy as I've seen like other people's be. My squishiest one like that is the baseball. It is super, super squishy. I love this one, and I love it's very soft. Very, very squishy got that. Um, I also have another random squishy is this Menchie's mascot squishy. We found this at the frozen yogurt shop and it was a dollar. It's like by the register and it is like extremely squishy. Love this one and it's really really cute. <clears throat> Next I have a Remint Hello Kitty white bun. This one is not squishy at all. It um I don't really like the texture either, but um, the Raymond ones that I have, I got from Kawaii Space on Store Envy. So I've got this one. I've got the regular Hello Kitty bun. This one's a little bit softer. And I have the Raymond Hello Kitty cake roll. And this is also pretty soft, but not very squishy. <clears throat> I've got this Relicuma Honey Toast. This is from Kawaii for Girls. It's super cute and um, soft, but it's not squishy. It's got a black cell phone strap, but it's it's so cute. I really, really like this one. <clears throat> and like other, another um, Sanex one that I have is, it's on my phone, it is this Corellacuma waffle and this is one of, this is my first squishy and it was before I really got into squishies and like knew what they were. <clears throat> so this one's like very very hard and I just got it as a, to be a charm like on my phone or on my DS but it's really 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 cute and this is from um, an Etsy seller called What's Your Crayon but yeah um, also from that seller I got this Corella Kuma Strawberry Cupcake and these aren't squishies at, at all either they're soft but you know they're not like very squishy. I got that one, and it was funny because I bought that one, and then I got this one as an extra from someone. So it's got the Relicuma strawberry cupcake. Um, also have some Relicuma cake rolls. So I've got the purple one with the yellow and the white inside. These are soft; they're not squishy, but I just like really liked the way this one looked, the colors. And then um, I got this pink one with the chocolate inside. And I think I got one of those from um, Store Envy and one from like Kawaii Land or something. Um, let's see. Another thing I got is this um, non-licensed Hello Kitty Mushroom. I really don't like this one. It's not squishy at all. It's very foamy and the color is just like not saturated at all. It's very different from like the real um, Hello Kitty in their costumes, and like the bottom is like kind of bulky and square. And I believe I got this one from Kawaii Land. I was not really happy with that one, but yeah, that's that one. Um, this one I got as an extra from K 
Hawaii, Korea with like when I ordered my roti toast from her. I got this. And I like this one. It's a little chocolate dip pretzel and this part is kind of made with the same stuff that like the breads are made out of. So it's pretty soft and it's got a black cell phone strap. I got this one I also gotten as an extra um I don't remember from where, but it's a Daisy Duck bun. I really, really like this one. It's very squishy and soft, and it's got, like, this weird texture to it, like the, um, I think it might be a, re a remit one. I'm not sure, though. It's got a Disney license on it. You can't really tell, but it, right there, so I'm not sure what it is, but I really like this one. Um, I've got a fake Hello Kitty Donut. This is the one I keep on my bag. It's not squishy, but it's very soft. Um, I've got this Hello Kitty bun from Kawaii Land. This is like my hardest squishy that I own. It's it's not soft at all. It's not squishy at all, but it is really cute. Let's see. Next, I have the Tutu Kawaii Toast. So I've got the crisscross one, and it comes with this cute little tag, pink ball chain, um, little plastic strawberry tag, and on the back it's got this cute little bear, and they smell very, very strong strawberry smell. They're not that squishy, and they're kind of small, but they're just very cute, and I love the toasts. So I've got that one, I've got this drizzle one. I love the feeling of them, and I love the feeling of the jam as well. I've got the heart one, which is my cute, my favorite design, is the heart one. And I've got the blob one. I think these are squishier than these are for some reason. So yeah, I've got those. Um, next, I've got some Cafe Sakura. I've got the Cafe Sakura croissant. I like the shape of it, the croissant shape, because it fits well in your hand, and these are pretty squishy. And they're shaded really, really well. The texture's a bit weird. They're, like, soft here, and then have, like, a shiny glaze on the top. And it's got the Cafe Sakura tag, a pink ball chain. I've got that color, and then I've got this one, which I like the best, is the light pink one. And it's also even squishier than that one. But, yeah those two. I've got um, two of the cake rolls. So I've got this one. I'm not sure like what the flavors are called. It's just like a normal one I guess. There's like this cool powdered sugar color here and yellow inside. And I like that one. It's not that squishy but it's very soft. It's got the Cafe Sakura tag and like um, very 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 tiny on the bottom is a Seabowl license got that color and I've got this one. I think I kind of like this brown one better for some reason. I don't know. The filling is just a different color and then the outside is darker. And it's also got the powdered sugar design and the Seabowl license and the Cafe Sakura tag. Then I've got, oh yeah, I forgot about this um, unlicensed Hello Kitty macaron. This one's pretty squishy, but it came, like, super, super defected. It was from a store envy. Um, who was it? I can't really remember. Uh, oh, Kawhi. It was from Kawhi-licious. I got something else from her, too, but I don't remember what it was. But I wasn't really impressed with either one of the squishies that I got from her. But, yeah. Also, the um, one that I have that it's not with me right now is a fake Hello Kitty biscuit ice cream sandwich. And it's on my sister's backpack right now, but I have but I have that one too. Um, let's see. Next, I have some more Cafe Sakura, and it is the Vanilla Eclair, which I really really like these. They have a very different consistency than most squishies. They're um just feel a lot thicker, and it's like a different kind of squishiness. This one's pretty. It's the vanilla icing with sprinkles, and I really like the color here. They don't have any texture on the bottom. They're like completely smooth. And they have um, Seabowl really, really tiny right there. And again, the same tag and ball chain. It's got the vanilla one. I've got the chocolate one. Let's see if you can see like the squishiness. I 
they're pretty squishy. I really like them. And I also have the strawberry one. This one's my favorite, and it's actually the squishiest one. It keeps happening, like my light pink ones are the squishiest, and they're my favorites. But this texture is so, so smooth. And these are pretty small. Um, all the Cafe Sakura is pretty small. It's got that size, the size of this one, and then this one's super, super small. And then my last two items for this video are my Cafe Sakura ice cream sandwiches. So I really, really love these. They have a little Sakura flower here with the Seabowl license. Um, same tag. This one is, it's like a regular cookie. It looks really orange, but it's not. They're very squishy. And this one's got the strawberry, or the raspberry filling, sorry, the raspberry filling. I really, really like these. I'm really excited for, um, I got these from Tutu Kawaii, by the way. Um, I'm really excited. She's supposed to be getting a small quantity of the other two colors, so I really hope I can get those. Um, also, by the way, these are from Kawaii Land. These are from Decadent Accessories. And uh, these are from Kawaii Land, too. So anyway, um, got those. But yeah, the ice cream sandwiches are from Tutu Kawaii, and I also ordered a um, white bread bun from her, too, the Sakura, Cafe Sakura white bread bun. And then I've got this one. I love this one. It's a pink biscuit with the caramel swirl filling, and they are just so, so, so soft. So yeah, I love those. So that is everything for this video, and I will see y'all for the second part of my collection, and bye!